Hello there, it's Kent Jackson from Uniques and Antiques coming to you from Aston, Pennsylvania for our modern design auction on September 19th. As usual, I do about a 10 minute walkthrough. You see what we have in the sale coming up on Tuesday. Uh, this, is the un this is the catalog portion of our mid-century modern design auction. Uh, I'm going to do a quick overview of the room just so you can see the scale of what's here. There's about 715 items in the catalog. And uh, we started lot number one at 11 a.m. and work our way through all the way up until probably 10, 11 o'clock at night. And maybe 10 o'clock at night when we, uh, we finish up. And meanwhile, there's a second section that's uncatalogued. Uh, that's going to start earlier in the day, 9 o'clock for the uncatalogued smalls and 9.15 for the uncatalogued furniture. So about three auctioneers are going to be selling at, at uh, two, uh, let's see, at, at, one, at 11 o'clock when we start the catalog. So I'm walking along here, just doing a quick overview, uh, the first couple of minutes of the, of the video, and then I'll walk up and down each, uh, each row and kind of give you a little more time to look at what's here. As you can see, it's a big sale. Everything's mid-century, modern design, decorator, Danish, Herman Miller, Hans Wegner, you name it. 700 lots. We do these sales every six weeks. About 2,000 lots in the auction. 700 of them are cataloged. Uh, so let's get started. Uh, we start at 11 o'clock for the catalog portion. We start over here, lot number one. You have Harvey Prober and Paul McCobb style, Mastercraft. Look at these great chairs with the uh, fancy sides. There's a pair of them. And you have a nice pair of lacquer tables all redone. Murano, Vanini, Venetian glass, uh, Atmos clock. There's some nice Picasso in the back here. Picasso smalls. You have uh, some good plates, some good uh, Scandinavian glassware, good flatware. Then we jump over here and continue on. Maitland Smith, a great Italian bench right here. Uh, Mastercraft style little cabinet. Uh, good lamps. That one's high in Fantoni, that little statue. Uh, Whittacombe, Knoll, Saarinen, Rosewood. Look at this great Rob John Gibbings table right here. Very nice all the way around. Somebody asked me to take a picture of the chip. It does have a tiny chip right there. And I think that's about it. But uh, nice early table. Good money on that table. Um, Sarid in the back there, some nice funky lamps in the back here, the Eames wire tables, those uh, paintings in the back are Peter Mack, not to be confused with Peter Max. So the consigner uh, called me and said, yeah, I have two, I have, I have two Peter Max paintings. And I'm like, great, Peter Max is good, but these are Peter Mack. So he wasn't wrong. They are Peter Max, both of them. Coming down here, uh, who's this guy? Leo Sewell, right here. And this one's even signed right here on the leg. Leo Sewell, right there. Very neat found art, you know, kind of junk sculpture. His, uh, his people usually do good money. The last one we sold brought over 3,000. Um, another Rob John chair, lamps, lighting. Coming around here, another highlight of the auction, the, the uh, Herman Miller by George Nelson. And then you have the Eames ESU unit. You don't usually find them in this good a condition. The, the, uh, it's an earlier edition, not the first, but an early one. Uh, so good, good quality Eames ESU unit. This came right out of a house. Came right out of someone's basement. It had you know, a bunch of toys and stuff on it. So it's a fresh to the market. Good glassware, Bakelite, Chrome. This is Singer & Sons. Very nice, good quality piece of furniture. There's drawers in the side of this. Moving along, Milo Bowman, Russell Woodard. Great mosaic top tables. This chair on top is Herman Miller. Nice little rocker, Noguchi style. Then we have Stacks on stacks of mid-century bedroom furniture, nesting tables, chrome lighting, good chairs, Dunbar. Both of these sets right here are Dunbar. Wormley on this side. These are Wormley for Dunbar. Very nice uh, kind of Edmund Spence style bedroom set right there. Look at the base on it. 
Coming around here, we're up to about 174 now, a few hours into the auction. Which reminds me, we take bids at the auction via live auctioneers and BidSquare. We also take absentee bids where you can tell us a price and we'll bid it on your behalf. We also do phone bids if you want to be on the phone for an item. Now, we don't take all phone bids. You have to start the item at at least 300 and uh, be a serious buyer. Otherwise, we request you leave an absentee bid. Down into the hallway here. Good wall sculptures, nail art, seat chair. That's Hans Wegner style. Look at that nice prover sectional couch more mastercraft going a little bit out of order because we don't do this side but this is how it is where we are good sets of chairs this is a uh, paul evans it's signed the paul evans cityscape underneath or on top of that is the uh herman miller rosewood chair right there signed herman miller with the ottoman real nice one somebody asked about the uh an issue with a repair. I don't see it right now. I'm going to have to stop and take a picture of it later. Nice looking Plycraft Hill Lucite down this aisle. I'm going to do it real quick. You can see both sides. Just take my word for it. You have good case pieces on the right and good dining room sets on the left. Same thing over here. Nice art on the walls, bar stools, um, Dunbar, Saarinen. By the way, these chairs right here are Knoll, Saren and for Knoll. They're even done in Knoll fabric, and there's a set of eight of them. Two armchairs, six side chairs. Very nice set. Condition of the upholstery is really good. It's a little bit, a little bit, I don't know, loose. I'm not, I'm not sure how you would upholster it tighter. It has a couple little folds, but it's super nice. All right, slat benches, Chesterfield sofas. Let me do this section uh, as I go backwards. Mastercraft. Good pottery lamps, Paul McCobb, which reminds me there's a ton of great Paul McCobb in the cob in the sale. Good 20 lots of Paul McCobb. Milo Bowman chairs right there. Look at these good consoles. Good French and Italian cocktail tables and coffee tables. Milo Bowman sofa right there. You have good uh, chandeliers in the back across the wall there. The Maryland uh, reprint of the Warhol. The estate certified one, the lithograph. Um, coming over here, let me go where Tim is right now. He's stickering some of the items. Good art. Nice little chandelier up there. And that's one of the reasons why people like to watch the videos. You can see how big these items are in uh, in position with other pieces of furniture. Like you see how large those lamps are, and and that um, that painting on top of the nice Paul McCobb uh, piece below at the Calvin. Get a good idea for scale when you watch the video. Some more Paul McCobb. This is the Paul McCobb row. Mastercraft in the back. Very nice Tommy Parzinger signed chest right there. All redone with a nice lacquer finish. All right, let me jump out into the lobby here. You have, uh, let's starting at the top here, you have the Laffer. You have the Eames screens. There's two of them. Very nice. All uh, apply, molded plywood. Here's a great collection of mobiles. Let me just do a quick, uh, you know, motion thing of the mobiles here. We can see how how they do. There's one, two, three, four, five, six of them. Very nice. And this is another case of you can't really tell how big they are in the picture. More art, benches, sets of chairs, nail art screen that goes all the way to the floor. This is a very nice Maitland Smith style. It says made in the Philippines on the bottom. Kidney shaped pedestal. Coming around here, along along the back of the wall there, you have some great rosewood. Another nice walnut wall unit. A good credenzas. This is um, Parsinger right here, the uh, yellow kitchen cabinet looking things. Parsinger original signed. This section right here is all the uncatalogued smalls. That start, section starts at 9 o'clock in the morning. Let me just do this row right here real quick. You have the rosewood stacking chairs, the rattan chairs, neat little chair right there, kind of Frank Lloyd Wright inspired. That's Singer and Sons. Uh, Weinberg looking little statue right there. Overman, Bowman, Brass and Glass. Here's another 
uh, Milo Bowman style, Plycraft, great lamp. Look at that with the colored tops, nesting tables. All right, let me come down this wall. Another great wall unit in the back right there. It has uh, rosewood. It even has feet. Very nice. Takes us a while to put these up, but once they're up, they look really good. There's three of those um, ball lamps by Light of Lear. So we probably should hang up all three of them. But uh, that being said, some chandeliers just left today. Uh, coming down here, another wall unit in the back. Nice one right there with glass shelves. This is a very nice table and chairs. Desks. All right, we're about 10 minutes in. You can kind of get a, get the gist. We finish out the room right here. If you've never been to one of our auctions later on in the day, we always order 10 pizzas or so, and everybody chows down, hangs out in this room, and we sell the last couple hours of the auction. Uh, the pizzas are free as long as you're uh, as long as you're here. <laughs> you must be present to eat pizza. All right, so selling uh, good good uh, Danish dining sets over here, outdoor sets. Um, the art on the back wall here is isn't part of the uncatalog section. I'll do a separate video for that stuff. Um, but as you can see, all this is cataloged, um, industrial. Get the sun chairs. All right, so you kind of see it. Hopefully you can make it to the auction. If you can't make it, come on Monday for preview. That portion starts at uh, 12 to 6 on Monday, the 18th of September. Otherwise, we'll see you at the auction. You can come in early in the morning, 8 o'clock on Tuesday. Get yourself a parking space. Get yourself a coffee at the Dunkin' Donuts or here. And uh, hang out for a while. We'll be here all day selling. All right, thanks for watching. This has been Ken Jackson from Uniques and Antiques. And we'll see you at the auction. Bye-bye.